Hey, Hussy. Hey. The bridge we are on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to, I think that's the cave. A cage. Yeah. A cage. A cave. Today on Logan Lee Adventures. Candy is set on a plateau surrounded by mountains which are home to tea plantations and biodiverse rainforests. So that's where we are today. It's listed as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO and is considered one of the most sacred places of worship in the Buddhist world. We're now off to explore. It's called the Rana Wana Royal Temple. And it's basically up in the hillside of Kandy. So, taking your shoes off. <laughs> he struggles a lot. <laughs> I do, I do. <laughs> and then we're gonna explore this temple uh, going all the way up. Say it with me now Ranawana Parana Raja Maha Viharaya. It's a hidden gem not to be missed out on, and just so happens we're the only ones here. This temple is built with maximum use of natural resources, and it's a very surreal place to see the whole theme of the temple tightly bound with nature. It's laid out that when we walk through these mountains to see the story of Buddha's life unfold in life-size statue before us. Even his toes are pink. Right? Why did they? I mean, because it's really accurate. <laughs> but it's not. No, look, it's more pink. Yeah, but not so much more pink. Maybe it's. it's Maybe he's really tan. You see that spider right there? Hey, don't do that. He's scared of spiders. No, I'm not. But <laughs> yes, these yeah. countries are not know. They can't be poisonous. <laughs> I just walked past that without even. Yeah, because you didn't touch it. Okay. Well, what if you don't see it? I'll show you a photo of the Indonesian one. It's oh crazy. my god. That's your big hat. Look, he made it pass. I'm so proud of him. Me too. <laughs> Located on a hill overlooking the city of Kandy lies the Bahira Vokakanda Vihira, a giant Buddha statue and one of the city's most notable religious monuments. The statue itself can be seen from most places throughout the city and since we climb all the way up, it's a great view looking down. We're just having a midday after temple. Oh wow, is this really soft? Mm. Lunch at Candy Kitchen um, with our seafood platter and it has a little bit of lobster, a little bit of squid, I see calamari and jumbo prawns and even tuna. Oh, okay. Can't wait to dig in. Sri Lanka is blessed with a large fishing ground filled with the most delicious bounties of the Indian Ocean as you can see from our plates. This country keeps on treating our stomachs so well. Kandy is famed for its sacred Buddhist sites including the Temple of the Tooth which houses Sri Lanka's most important Buddhist relic, a tooth of the Buddha. During Puya, which is offerings or prayers, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but the heavily guarded room housing the tooth is open to devotees and to the public. However, you don't actually see the tooth. It's kept in a gold casket. The tooth was smuggled into Sri Lanka in 313 AD after being taken away from the Buddha as he laid on his funeral pyre. Poor guy just couldn't get a break. Inside this temple are elaborate carvings and painted with exotic woods, lacquer, and ivory. It's truly a feast for our eyes, between the bursts of colors from the offerings and lotus flowers to the scent of these burning candles.
gonna have a cup of tea. Ooh. How cute. <laughs> We're just having some tea from this tea factory. We got shown like the process of how tea was made. I did not know that it takes 22 hours from leaf to tea and just the whole process and how much you can get out from just one single leaf of tea. But now we're gonna sample our teas. Think of high. Cheers! No cheers. Oh, cheers. The whole process of growing takes longer than 22 hours. Yeah. Just a side. <laughs> Continuing our cultural day in Candy, after the tea factory, we're now at a spice garden to learn about all the different spices of Sri Lanka. This is called spice tea. No spice tea. sugar, no honey. Uh, do you know vanilla? Yeah. Two drops vanilla. And you know ginger? No, oh, ginger, you smell that. Yeah. Ginger, ginger smell. Ginger smell. Ooh. Yeah. Minimum this size, maximum this size. Are you serious? Yes, yeah. not big. Okay. We call jungle pineapple. That's how? This one. Okay. The yellow rice. Yellow rice biryani. Ah, also. okay. That's the color. Yes. Uh, didn't know you can make something so much out of plants. Making brown color cinnamon stick. Yeah. This is using for cooking and making tea also. Mm, yeah. And we have medicine, you know, some people city's heart is scenic candy lake which is also the Bogambara lake. It's actually an artificially constructed by the last king of Sri Lanka and candy. Also called the milky ocean, several legends are connected to the candy lake and it's believed that the king installed a secret tunnel from its island to the palace. Nowadays, it's just a beautiful stroll to escape the bustle of the city. Thanks for tuning into our time in candy. Hit subscribe if you haven't already and leave us a comment on your thoughts about Sri Lanka so far. Give this video a like and we'll catch you in our next adventure.